What's up, YouTube? We're back at it again. This time, we're thrifting. I'm going to show you what I got. Um, I'm going to just post up the pictures because I've already taken off the tags and everything because I want to give them hurry up and post it on eBay. But anyway, this is what we're doing. Let's get into it now, man. What's up, everybody? What's up? All right, y'all, let's get into it, man. Now, look, this is my first time thrifting, so bear with me. Please let me know if it was a good buy, a bad buy. I should have left it. Good thing I took it. Give me the thumbs up. If you don't like this video, give me a thumbs up anyway. Make sure you subscribe, too, all right, because we got a lot more stuff coming up. All right, anyway, look, this first one was a, um, it was a Echo Limited. Now, look, peep game. I saw the tag. And it looked like an old school tag. So I figured this is an old shirt. Looks like it's really good condition. Purplish, long sleeve button up. Um, I did pay $6.49. I felt it was kind of high for a thrift item. But, you know, I got to get my feet wet and see what's up. I'm going to post this one up for probably just like $19.99 plus the shipping handling and all that. See what I can do with it and go from there, you know. Um, the second one was, I can't even pronounce the name, Jay Fari. I'm going to say Jay Fari. Um, F E R R A R. It's a look like a it's like a polo type sweater, not a shirt. It's a sweater. Um, it looks real smooth and everything. When I was taking pictures of it, it didn't look right on the pictures. I gotta take some better pictures or something. But anyway, um, this one I paid uh, five ninety nine for. It was no no holes in it, no flaws or nothing. Everything was smooth. I liked it, so I went on and just took a chance with it. The name looked very important. If you guys know anything about the name. Um, drop a comment. Let me know. All right. J Fari. You see it right here like that. Again, $5.99. I'm going to post it up for maybe $24.99 and take the best offer and go from there. Um, this next one was a, it's a youth girls blouse. Did I say that right? I thought it was women's, but I forgot I was in a little girl section, but it was chaps and it was smooth. It didn't have any flaws in it. No. I mean, it was like clean. The only thing it was missing was the brand new tags. Um, this one, it was only $3.99, so I figured, all right, let me go on and get it. It's like, it's a nice button up. Look like a blouse a woman will wear to like an office or something, but it's for youth. But maybe like a petite woman can fit it. I don't know. I'm going to post this one up for probably $19.99. You know what I'm saying? Everything is like $19.99 for some reason. Plus shipping handling. We'll see what happens. Um, then me being a big Star Wars fan, I had to get this one right here. It's a Star Wars shirt. Sleeves are cut off. Um, if you look at the designs inside, it's like a camel type. Um, so I did want to get this one. Um, it was only uh, $3.99. And um, it was clean all over. Just dirty around the collar. Washed it. Everything's clean on it. No holes or nothing. I'm just like, man, I'm getting lucky. So pretty cool, right? So anyway, for that one, I will probably just post up $14.99. Star Wars coming out in December, I guess. And then the new Star Wars land opening up at Disneyland. Had to take a chance with it. See what happens. This next one, though, I'm in love with this one. USC, um, it's a double XL, I think, um, by Nike pullover. And I'm looking at it, man. I'm like, I'm waiting for where's the stains at? Where's the rips? Where's the loose thread or something? Nothing for $4.99. I had to jump on it, went on and got it, looked it over again. No stains or nothing. Looked around the collar, um, a little dirty around the collar. So I ended up washing it, man. It's good. This one I'm actually posted for $29.99. I saw some comps on it. I think they're around about that much. I didn't see one like mine, so I figure mine's a stand out. So 30 bucks plus shipping handling. See, you know, when the season starts, we'll go from there. Um, now this one right here, now get, don't get me wrong, I don't know nothing about soccer. Okay. I know Chivas USA, Chivas over in Compton. That's it. Okay. But this was Liverpool. Now I know it's a soccer jersey because I know how to tell. Well, anyway. I didn't know nothing about it. I saw comps on it. It's selling like hotcakes. And I'm like, okay, let me go on and grab it. For $4.99, I'm going to take advantage of it, okay? They had to actually get a price on it for me. So it was $4.99 at the Goodwill. Um, got to work. One of the homies at work told me like, hey, man, this is a good jersey. They're number one right now. They beat Barcelona and all this and that. But I need to hurry up and sell it. Now, I did have it posted up for $29.99. But since I was in a rush to sell it, I went to $19.99. And then sold within 24 hours. I've showed it up right here so you can see. Um, this next one is um, American Flags. 
swimming trunks. I actually thought it was um, board shorts, but it was some swimming trunks. And I figured 4th of July coming up, Memorial Day, why not go ahead and get them? But when I looked at the comps, man, it was flooded. It was just flooded. But $4.99, I'm gonna go ahead and take a chance. It seemed like everything in here was $4.99, by the way, okay? Um, this next one was a Superman shirt. It was a cut off sleeves, uh, $4.99 again. Um, everything was good on it. Uh, wasn't nothing wrong with it or anything, man. So I had to take a chance on it. Um, I don't know if DC Comics coming out with, I think they're coming out with a new Batman or something, maybe Superman. I don't know, but it's Superman shirt tags inside. Everything's good on it. Had to take a chance on it. So I got it. All right. This next one is, um, okay. Now this one right here, check this out. It's a USC. It's like a gray on black, black on gray. Um, nice clean. I'm looking at it. I'm like, okay. This is too good to be true. Um, this one was, I want to say this was $4.99. This was a dry fit too. It was a Nike dry fit USC shirt. So I was like, oh, hell yeah, I'm getting this one right. I'm looking at it and everything. I'm all excited and all that. Um, I didn't even check for comps. I just like the shirt, period, right? I get home, got a big old stain right there in the stomach area. I'm like, oh my God, here we go. So anyway, went ahead, tried to clean it out. It didn't work. But try to clean it out one more time. If not, got to post it up as is with the stain in it. It sucks, though. But the shirt is so clean and nice. I, if I could fit it, I'll wear it. But anyway, $4.99. Uh, if I could get the stain out, I'm going to post it up for at least $19.99. Um, if I can't get the stain out, it'll go lower than that. We'll go from there. We'll see. Um, this next one is um, snowboarding pants. Now, I just saw the pants there, and I grabbed them right away um, because they just look expensive and big and stuff like that now the price on there was 10.99 this week at the goodwill it was half off on the white tickets so i got it for like 550 and some change well, 550 plus tax <clears throat> so anyway snowboarding pants i saw comps on snowboarding pants man 40 50 bucks 60 bucks i could have swore i saw something for like 80 or 90 um I don't know if I'm gonna sit on these for a while or whatnot, but for five dollars and something, and I'm gonna push them up to at least about 40, 30, 40 dollars. They were clean, no stains or nothing. I washed them, everything's clean on it, so I was cool with it like that. Um, the other one, let me see, was there any more else? I think that's it. Did I get everything? I probably got some more. But anyway, those I think that was like 10 items right there I picked up at the Goodwill. Anyway, do me a favor, drop a comment. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know which item I should have left behind and which item I did good on. Let me know if you think it's going to sell. Do what you got to do. Let me know. Criticize me. Drop a comment. Do what you got to do. I need to learn, okay? My next adventure is yard selling. As soon as this weather clear up a little bit, I'm going to do some yard selling, and we're going to go from there. Anyway, uh, peace, deuces, and um, subscribe. Tell a friend. Tell your mama, your baby daddy, uncle, cousin brother, sister-in-law, and don't forget to share the video. All right, I'm out. Peace.